Do you know, my brothers, many of us are Muslimin. We are now old, 40, 45, 50, 55, sometimes older. We still do not know what is the message in the Quran. We still don't know it. How? My brothers, it has become so easy for us today to get an authentic CD or to have a little DVD, put it in a little CD, put it in some type, form of a book or sit in a lecture. And as I said, you are sitting in Makkah al Mukarramah. It is very, very simple to learn the meaning of the Quran in a city like this with technology of this nature. Walk into any bookstore, they will give you something to benefit by the will of Allah. But have we learned the meaning of the Quran? That is a question. That is why sometimes we are weak. Our Iman is weak. I was born. I, I either was born a Muslim or became a Muslim. And after that, I studied so that I can get a job. Allah's gift, He made me get a job in Makkah. Now, my job will help me to send money back home. My job might help me in order to be able to live comfortably, to buy some food. But the day I die, will my job have helped me? The answer is no. Only if you arrive, as Allah says, only if you have arrived with a pure heart. What is a pure heart? A pure heart is that heart which is not contaminated with shirk or with association of partnership with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. That heart which is pure. How are you going to know how to worship Allah when you don't know what the Quran said? What is the word of Allah? The word of Allah is the Quran. He sent it to you and to me. So sometimes we have read books so that we can pass our examination. We want to learn English. We want to learn French. We want to learn other languages. We want to study higher to get this degree and that degree. I was in Sri Lanka two weeks ago and they told me here in this country, many people have so many degrees, not just one. One, two, three degrees. Subhanallah, we want to study. We want to get a job. We want to get a promotion. How many of us want to get a promotion in understanding the word of Allah, my maker? When you understand Allah's word, that is the time you will be able to worship Allah correctly. <laughs> Those who are truly fearful of Allah, subhanahu wa ta'ala, those who have the proper consciousness of Allah are those who know, those who have some form of knowledge. If you don't know what is the consciousness of Allah or who is Allah, or if you don't know what is the message of Allah, how will you know how to worship Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala? You won't.